I have spent the last four years searching for a great charger for my bedside. When Apple launched MagSafe on the iPhone 12, that search became a little more focused. When Mafi introduced its snap ring adapters that can basically make any Android phone MagSafe compatible, that search became laser focused. Now, the search may be over, the Belkin Boost Charger Pro 3 inch minus one wireless charging pad is about as close to perfect as I've gotten thus far. So, welcome to our new product review episode. If you are new in our channel then please subscribe our channel and press bell icon for notification of our new videos. This is a flat slab covered with a soft touch silicone finish that is a little hard to keep clean. It measures 9 inches by 3 inches by 0.8 inches, so it's fairly large. There are three charging areas, one MagSafe charger for your phone, one charger for your Apple Watch, and one designed for your AirPods that's really just a Qi charger. I mostly used it to charge my Anchor Soundcore Liberty Pro 3 earbuds but occasionally used it to charge a second phone. There is a single LED light that shows when your AirPods are charging, but there are no other LED light indicators since your phone and smartwatch presumably have their on-screen indicators. The MagSafe charging plate for the iPhone is raised slightly, ensuring a good, solid connection. The Apple Watch stand flips up, so it can charge either vertically or horizontally, depending on your preference. The Apple Watch holder is also adjustable depending on what size Apple Watch you have. It can rise up if needed to make room for the casing, which is an important design flourish. The magnets on both the MagSafe charging puck and the watch charger are very strong and won't allow either device to slip. That's really all there is to it. The Belkin 3-inch minus 1 Boost Charge Pro works well, the magnets are solid and you can charge as much as you need to. I like this device because the magnets ensure my phone and watch stay connected even if I bump them at night. There are times that I would prefer more of a phone stand that holds my phone upright so I can read or check notifications, but on a bedside table, that's an okay compromise. Once I set my phone down on the charger, I shouldn't be looking at it anyway. The watch flips up, so I can use that as a small clock if I need, and that's good enough. The main benefit here is that the Belkin Boost Charge 3-inch minus 1 charger is updated to support both Apple's 15-watt wireless charging for iPhones and fast charge for the Apple Watch Series 7. Personally, I have an Apple Watch SE, so I can't take advantage of that particular trait, but maybe you can. How the charging pad gets its power is not ideal. The Belkin Boost Charge uses a barrel plug that rotates into the base to lock it in place. That's fine, but I would always prefer a USB-C connector so it's easier to travel with. The power adapter on the other end is huge as well. The plug takes up three outlets in my power strip, which is not ideal. I actually picked up some one-foot extension cords to mitigate that. It makes my power strip a bit messier, but at least I get my plugs back. The Belkin Boost Charge Pro 3-inch minus 1 charger is available from Belkin's website for $150. Orders have already started shipping. Thanks for watching this video. If you think this video is useful, then please give a like in this video and share with others. Bye for now.